I told y'all this is not going to just be any ordination service. This is, we're going to let the Spirit do what He wants to do, and this is what we do. Amen. 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 But you got to be ready, kids, on the inside. Amen. He says, I will pour out my Spirit upon all flesh, and your sons and your daughters shall prophesy. That's your scripture. Honey, that's your scripture. And your young men will see visions, and your old men will dream dreams. Acts 2, 19 says, and the same man had four daughters, virgins, which did prophesy. And let me explain one thing about prophecy. And prophecy is not just about edification. There's a lot of teaching in the prophetic. There is a lot of instruction, direction that is given in the prophetic. Amen? Amen. Judges 4, verse 4 through 6. And Deborah, a prophetess, the wife of Lapidoth. She judged Israel at that time. Verse 5. And she dwelt under the palm tree of Deborah between Ramah and Bethel and Mount Ephraim. And the children of Israel came up to her for judgment, meaning justice. Verse 6. And she sent and called Barak, the son of Abnon, out of Kadesh and Naphtali. And she said unto him, Have not the Lord gave have not the Lord God of Israel commanded, saying, Go draw toward Mount Tabar, and take with thee ten thousand men of the children of Naphtali and the children of Zubar? That's the Old Testament, right there. God used a woman to be over men and women, to give prophetic words, to teach, to instruct. Because at that time, he didn't find a man faithful. He was trying to teach them a lesson. Amen? Amen. God is raising up, as I said, powerful, strong women. Powerful, strong women. Say, I am. I am. Powerful. Powerful. In God. In God. Nobody. Nobody. Will ever. Will ever. Take that from you. Take that from you. In Yeshua's name. In Yeshua's name. Yeshua's name. Amen. Amen. The Bible tells us in Isaiah 43.10, You are my witnesses, says the Lord, and my servant whom I have chosen, that you may know and believe me and understand I am he. Before me there was no God formed, neither shall there be any after me. So God himself has chosen Minister Felicia Lewis and Minister Moran. This had nothing to do with favoritism. Matter of fact, the Bible speaks against favoritism. This was his choosing. He 